I have so much good, fun, new stuff to share with you all. I'm excited to do this kind of chatty new planner setup. I want to show you what I'm going to be using for August in my Planner Perfect. I have a sneak peek of something very special here. I'm using some new things. We're just going to chat and have a great time together. If you are new to my channel, welcome. My name is May. I create content about planning, organization, productivity, and all kinds of things that I love. So I hope that you'll stick around and subscribe or give me a follow. One of the most exciting things I can tell you all is that I have a new show on Amazon Live, which is incredible. So if you're not watching me there, make sure to check the description box below. I will have a link to my Amazon Live show every single week. We um, just have a lot of fun. We chat, we shop on Amazon together. It really is a dream come true for me. So I'm so excited to have this new opportunity happening. So I wanted to tell you guys to check that out. Okay, actually, before I go into this, let me kind of just give you an overview of my system and kind of what I'm using to stay organized right now. Um, I am back in my trusty essential daily planner. This has this is the second year in a row that this thing has really just been the best for me. I, I really love it. I kind of go in and out of it, but it's amazing. I have a setup video on my channel going through this in detail, a review video. Um, but as you can see, it's vertical. It has a space for notes and it's timed. Everything is just clean and chic and simple. Um, this year they added the tabs. This is an Amazon purchase. So I love this. Um, and I always say that a calendar and a planner are two different things. So this is what I use as a planner in the sense that like, I like to look at this day and say, okay, I have tasks that I need to get done. I have to do's that I need to get done. I'm going to assign those to a day. So I view this as a planner in that sense. I may not necessarily use these timed slots to keep track of appointments. Um, I do that digitally. I have for years. I just use a Google Calendar and that's really where I keep my appointments because I have several during the day. They move around. I'm dependent on other people's schedules. I have Zoom meetings all kinds of things. So appointments go in a digital calendar, but the big things that may impact what I can get done in a day, I may write those down here. So again, I'm not using this to plan my time. I'm using it to really plan how I'm going to get things done and how I will use the day to accomplish what I need to accomplish. So this is really a planner in that sense. It may not be extensive to-dos, but it may be things that have to get done on a certain day. So this is what I use as a planner. I also am using this love, this clear disc bound system. I love this thing. So this is really just a notebook that I'm using to keep my thoughts organized, to plan out some projects, um, but more of just more note taking, I would say, um, and some to do lists. Um, I will look at the month overview and write down things that I need to get done in the month. But this is more of just like a day to day working notebook. This is also from Amazon. I built this whole disc bound system from Amazon, the clear covers, this beautiful paper and these clear discs. So I'll have all of that linked for you as well. So these two things are really my day to day, what I'm using um, in like the meat of my day and what I need to get done is here. And this is what I really use, but special announcement. I'm so excited. Actually, you guys are the absolute first to know about this. I have not announced it anywhere else yet. Um, I will be doing a free live masterclass on Sunday, August 1st. So if you're watching this before Sunday, August 1st, you can join us free. Um, there's a workbook that you can get. I'll have all that linked down below. But my official like public announcement to the whole world is going to be then. So you guys are finding out about this even before then. But I have designed 
seasonal planner pages. So we are moving into August. In my opinion, this is the best time of year. August just kicks off back to school, but also it's kind of like a clean break in the year. We're transitioning to fall. We're transitioning into Q4 starting in September. It's just a time to really get a clean slate and make sure that we refocus, we reclaim the rest of the year, we reboot. Um, so the class that I am, master class that I'm hosting on Sunday is called Reclaim and Reboot because we're really going to focus on not only reviewing what has happened this past few months of this year, seven, eight months of this year, um, but we're also going to look at the next four months and what, or five months, August, September, October, November, December, five months, and what we're going to accomplish. We're going to set clear goals. We're going to manifest it's going to be amazing. So I hope that you guys can join me on Sunday, National Planner Day. It is totally free. There is a workbook that you can download. So all that will be linked below. But now let's talk about this planner. So I'm going to be debuting this planner on Sunday during the masterclass. I'm going to tell everyone about it. Um, but this is just really how my brain works. This is how I organize things. This is a digital planner. And it's seasonal because this is solely focused on the next five months. It's focused on August through December. Um, we're going to focus on August and then really focus on Q4 and make sure that we are getting things done October, November, December. So August, September are kind of our, our grace period um, where we clean the slate, but all five of those months are included here. So let me just give you a little sneak peek. It does have the calendar pages. I keep this on a clipboard on my desk. I'm using this every single day, just on a beautiful acrylic keyboard, um, clipboard, excuse me, but it has all of the month overviews. Actually, I'm going to take this whole thing out. So, and it is a digital download, which means you can print this as many times as you need and use these calendars for any purpose that you need. So, it has all of the calendars, November through December, has a spot for notes, habits, or affirmations. And then here's really where the work starts. So there's a page to do your end of year dreams. There's a vision board. And then there's weekly and daily pages as well. So again, these are digital downloads, which means you can download and print these for all the rest of the weeks of the year. Um, but there's a lot of different styles for each day and I this is how my brain works like these are actually my pages the reason that I made this planner is because nobody else had one and I wanted this and I wanted to be able to reuse these over and over again and I couldn't find anything that worked the way my head worked so sometimes my daily pages will be broken up like this where I have to do and go then my profession professional and personal things that I need to get done. So sometimes that's what my day looks like. Sometimes my day looks like this, who I need to contact, follow up, wellness I wanna focus on, home. Like there's so many different varieties. This one is just blank that you can fill it in. Here is another one. There's sometimes my days look like this where I have my schedule because I have a lot going on. I wanna have it written. And then I may do an affirmation and my to-do. So. There's so many different options. There's the weekly. I will have this link down below for you guys. I will do a proper video so you can look at this, um, planning out my morning routine. Again, this is called a seasonal planner for a reason because we're focusing on this last season of the year. The next five months, we're gonna go out with a bang, really be intentional, and so that's what this is designed for. So wanted to show this to you guys. This is what I will be using my system along with these. And then my, the last part of my system is my Planner Perfect. I have shared this in the past, but I absolutely love this system. This I'm looking in the camera is looks a lot more gold on the camera, but in real life, it's a really lovely rose gold. It has a pink to it. This is real leather from Planner Perfect. I do have a code that you can use for Planner Perfect, um, but it is not, does not apply to the leather. So Maybad 20 will get you 20% off your purchase, including the subscription box, which I'm gonna show you the August one. 
and how I set this up, but it does not work on the leathers and it is a one-time use. So I definitely recommend getting one of these beautiful leathers and then all the goodies that go inside. So if you've never seen Planner Perfect, these are just the most beautiful, just really, really lovely, well-crafted traveler's notebooks. The covers are thick. They have lovely artwork. I've said this in the past, but I really created, I craved warmth in my routine and Planner Perfect has really filled that for me. It's just really beautiful artwork. Like look at the month of July. This whole book is for the month of July. So actually let me show you um, for August. Here is the August subscription box. Again, you can get this box. Maybad 20 will get you 20% off. But for August, it's a super fun leopard. August is also my birthday month, so I was excited to see this leopard because I love that. And then it comes with this beautiful Make It Happen journal. This is a really like a light blue color and then a beautiful um, artwork, original watercolor artwork on the front and the back. And then the cool thing about these subscription boxes is that they include lots of accessories. So you can get just the planner itself, just the journal itself, just the accessories by themselves, or like mix and match um, all of that as well. So all the options are on the website. Before I show you the accessories, let me show you the inside because I always get this question. Really nice, thick paper, by the way. I don't like the thin paper. This is thick and really nice. So it has the monthly overview. Then we go into the goal pages and then the weeks followed by blank pages afterwards. So this is just the end of the month, but here's the beginning of August, the entire week at a glance, and then enough daily pages to have one page per two per spread here. So these two pages for one day, and then the weekend shares a spread. So I just, I love it. I absolutely love these journals and I'm gonna show you guys how I'm using it. Also comes with a month in review. So. The journal, the journal, the planner, and then there is beautiful washi. This has some artwork on it. This is Jenny's original artwork. This one says, write a better story. And then the stickers. And I will say this again, the stickers, you have to get them in your hand to see the quality. It's really thick, kind of glossy, kind of matte. It just feels good. And they're really fun designs. This month is really different than anything I've seen from Planner Perfect, which I love. I think that's awesome. So these fun coffee cups. I love this. I can't wait to see what September has for fall. Um, and then there's also tip ins included as well. So there's six designs and two of each of those. So I wanted to show you guys that really quickly. Um, I have lots of other Planner Perfect videos on my channel, so check those out if you wanna see more in depth of the boxes. But I have been using this and I'm going to add it in. I'm gonna take out my July book. I'm gonna add August. I've been using this as really my dream catching, scripting, affirmation book. I love this for that. Um, I like to script out my days in the sense of not my schedule, but scripting out how I want to feel, how much money I want to make, affirmations, quotes. I use this as a spiritual journal and we'll put writings from the Baha'i Faith in here. I just use this as a feel-good journal. So Instead of really trying to plan out my schedule or my calendar or tasks or any of that, I'm using this for the feeling side of planning, which if you are familiar with affirmations and manifestation and um, the world of really like our thoughts creating our reality, which is something I, I truly believe in, Manifestation talks a lot about you have to think about how you want to feel and what it's going to feel like when you achieve your goals. So I use this to write out like my ideal day. So if I was living everything ideally, exactly how I would want it, how is that day going to go? So I may script that here. Another day I may write my affirmations or a quote, a spiritual quote. Um, another day I may write out 
my dreams and my goals. I may write a letter to myself as if everything has already been accomplished. Like I like to think about writing a letter as if it is December 31st of whatever your year you're in. Like look back at the year and say, what did we accomplish? How cool was that? So I really want to fill these pages with those dreams and manifestations and affirmations. So I'm excited to use the August Planner Perfect Planner um, book for that purpose specifically. So it's going to be full of just dreams and goodness and all the like a yummy juicy things that I want to come to life are going to be on these pages. So I'm really, really looking forward to that. I started that practice in July, um, probably the second week of July, I started doing that and it felt so good. So look how cute this cover is. I just love, love Planner Perfect Design. So um, really scripting out my life um, and my days and my ideal days and affirmations and all that good stuff is what's going to go in these August pages. So that is my updated setup. That's everything that I'm using. I know it's a lot, but um, that is my planner piece. I made a planner piece video several years ago and I really still stick by that. I think we have to have grace with ourselves, especially those of us that are in the planner community and have been in it for a long time and love to try different things. That is okay. Have fun and try different things. Here is the pen that I'm using, the Energel liquid gel. I love, this is the best pen. I love these pens. They feel so good on the Planner Perfect paper. They feel so good on this paper. So I'll have everything linked down below for you guys. Don't forget, if you can join me on August 1st, National Planner Day for the free masterclass, we're going to set up the rest of our year. We're going to get on purpose and be intentional and make sure that we're getting things done. If you want the seasonal planner, I will link that down below for you as well. Thank you so much for watching. Please make sure that you subscribe, follow, give this a thumbs up and a heart, and make sure that you connect with me on Amazon Live as well. I hope that I can shop with you and um, spend time with you soon. Thanks again so much for watching. Bye.